sternum, they'll have you'll have them take their bra, their necklace, and everything off. And then I'm gonna have her face the board. She's gonna get as close as she can. And I'm just gonna move her in her REO. And it's 10 to 20 degrees. And you're gonna enter the elevated side. Or 15 to 20, I'm sorry. So I'm just poking for her jugular notch. I just want to make sure I have a little bit of light above that. And if you're not sure where to center up and down, it's also at T7. So if you want to feel for her inferior border of her scapula, that's exactly where you're centering. And then you'll just mark. It's really hard to see you. Some people you might get a little bit of light above the, above the shoulder, but most people you won't see it. So I'm just gonna mark the left side. And shield. She can do shallow breathing on this just to blur the lung markings out, or you'll just have her say, or just have her hold her breath. And then that's it for that. Okay, so you do your REO and then you go into your lateral. So it's always left lateral. So if you know that you got the top of it on your um, PA a week, I wouldn't move this up and down at all. So she's going to put her arms behind her back and then she's going to push her chest out as much as she can. And I'm just going to make sure she's nice and lateral. So I have a little bit of light above the jugular notch and she's going to take a big deep breath in and hold it and breathe. Okay, you can relax. Okay, and that's it. So it's at 72. 